All right, let's go to, uh, you know what? We asked uh, for Zach to call, and he did. He's the mm-hmm. one who was fired uh, for, I guess, not believing. He was th- th- fired for his thought crime. Uh, Zach in Maine, hi, you're on the blaze. Hi, how's it going? It's an honor to be here. Uh, it's great to have you. So you were fired. First of all, you were fighting against the mask, and then you said, okay, I'll wear one, and that wasn't good well, enough because you didn't believe in them. Yeah, it wasn't even so much resistance or fighting. I simply, like, I've been out of work since around March, and they've been waiting to call us back. Mm -hmm. And I went in to take a tour to see the changes they've made. And they said, you know, we'd be wearing a mask, and it's a very hot environment. I have a strenuous job moving seafood. I'm climbing up and down ladders. I have diabetes. I'm also a a fat man. You know, I get warm. I overheat. So I just expressed that concern. Yeah. And they said, oh, okay, well, you know, we'll look into a face shield and you, you could do this, you could do that. I also mentioned perhaps getting a doctor's note. They said they wouldn't be comfortable with that, that I'd have to wear something. So I agreed to a face shield. And two days after purchasing it, as it's coming in the mail, they texted me to let me know that me and my daughter would no longer be required, specifically because I don't believe in the face mask. She uh-huh. told me that she needed people that were on the same page and that whether I wore the mask or not, if I didn't believe in keeping the That's other employees unreal. safe. Unreal. And you have you have that. It, did they email you that? Text. I have the text, text. and I plan okay. on tweeting it. I just uh, was oh, able to edit man. her cell phone number and her name. Okay. That way I'm not like, you know, doxing her or something. Right. Like, right. Yeah, you don't want to do want that. people to see the text, and, but I and, don't want her to receive any you, harassment or anything. You like need this. a lawyer to see say, that text. You, you need to make sure you don't delete that text. You can mm-hmm. save it in your phone and show it to your attorney later this afternoon when you hire one. Yeah, we are going to look into that. That's um, crazy. Financially, we're not great, you know, to yeah. uh, get a lawyer, but if we can find something free, like a pine tree legal or something, would be a very big help. Right. Um, but I'm thinking if, if you get a... We live in a at-will state, so I'm not sure what my rights are. Mm-hmm. Well, look, I bet you could find a free consultation from some attorney who, Absolutely. when he hears the specifics And somebody case, who takes it on contingency, and, right. you know, and you only pay if you win. But I, I can't imagine it's okay to fire somebody for, for their belief structure or, or the things that they think. That's just, that's so wrong. Uh, yeah. pre- appreciate it, Zach. Very, oh. very 1984. I was about to yes. say. Yes, it is. Of, uh, exactly that. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. it is. The two plus two equals five scene. Right. You know, it's okay that you said it, Wally, but you don't believe it. <laughs> right. That's right. Uh, appreciate the call. Thanks. And, and good luck. Hope you All find right. something appreciate soon. Keep us updated. Yeah, yeah, keep us updated. If wow. I can make a suggestion, Pat, I mm-hmm. would like that no matter what happens with the football season, mm-hmm. I'm I'm really, really waiting for some more on trivia. Yeah, it's uh I mean, appreciate the call. Thanks. Um that's probably a good idea because we need it. Yeah. Yeah, we need a day where we just screw around and and that would uh that would en- enable us to do that. And feel free to direct message me some more on trivia questions because I may or may not have a lot ready for the new season okay (laughs) you may or may not yeah i'm leaning toward may not huh that's weird 